What's up everybody? I'm about to bid on a Golbat first edition fossil set. It's a PSA 10. There's about 300 in the world. Stay tuned because we're also going to open some packs from Brilliant Stars. All right, so it looks like we have about six minutes left. 1999 Pokemon card fossil number 34 Golbat first edition PSA 10. As you guys know, I love collecting PSA 10s. I don't really see any point of collecting anything else unless it's a 10. Like, I'm trying to complete the collection. I don't want a 9. I don't want an 8. I don't want an ungraded card unless I think it's going to be a 10. So, I just go for 10s. And there's only 300 of these in the world. So first, we're going to look at the price of it. I know a lot of you guys are going to say... It's already overpriced. There's five minutes left. Five bids, $41. It's only worth $40 on price chart. Yes. But you have to take in consideration. This is $40 PSA 10 right here. You can see it. However, it's only a sale a month. And there's only 300 of these in the world. So at any point in time, if there's not one listed, someone could be like, hey, this is $80. This is $120. This is $600. This number is kind of fake if you're actually going for a collection mindset and you want to complete the entire sets of them, base sets, fossil sets, gym sets, whatever it is you're trying to complete. The price of this price chart doesn't really matter. This just kind of gives you a heads up of what your card value or collections actually worth. But $40 is what it's saying PSA 10 is basically at. So here we go, four minutes. I do have some brilliant stars packs that we're gonna open. And um, it's about, it looks like 10 of them. Brilliant stars is by far my favorite TCG modern pack. I mean, you could literally hit two in a row it, in, in one pack, it's crazy. I've pulled the alt art Charizard and countless other cards. It's, it's, it's my favorite pack, hands down. Three minutes, 39 seconds. All right, here we go. We're gonna do the pack trick. You take out this card, show the code. One, two, three, four, put them to the back. Here we go. Obviously the most valuable card in this set is the Charizard Alt Art, which I have pulled before. I have it right behind me, I'll show you in a second. I need to send it in to get graded. It looks very good. It looks like a PSA 10, but it could easily be a 9. Just depends on how they grade it. And here we go. What is it, boys? Boss's order. Here, let me show you real quick. This is one of my favorite cards. This is from the Brilliant Stars set. Charizard alt art. It has the epic fight. You don't see epic fights on cards very often. This is a Venusaur versus a Charizard and they're an intense battle. So this is being called the modern era Charizard, basically holy grail. Everyone wants this card. They want it in a PSA 10. In a PSA 10, it's like 700 bucks. So this is a very good card to have. Think of the Charizard in 98 or 99. This is the modern version of that. So, two minutes and we're going for this gold bat. Let's open some more packs. Same trick. Take the card off the top. Code. One, two, three, four to the back. Here we go. A Lapras non-hollow that might be the two this is the last pack we're gonna be able to open before 
we have to bid on this card. But that might be one of the worst. One, two, three, four. To the back. 50 seconds. Here we go. Ooh, Moltres, hollow. Decent card, obviously nothing special. 27 seconds, we don't have time to open the pack yet. Let's go ahead and try to get this bad boy. It's a great card to add to the collection. I'll be willing to go up to $60. So at the last second, maybe four seconds left or so, I'll lock in for 60. I'll go 62 just for hex of it. I don't think this goes over 50. Winning at 42, four seconds. So it's at the phase when it determines the winner. It usually takes 15 seconds. We'll open a pack before we refresh and see if we won it. One, two, three, four. This is like the worst luck on camera ever. One holographic out of four packs. Well, let's see if our luck turned around. I'm about to refresh the screen and we're gonna find out if we took this or not. Won the auction, $42, $8 expedited shipping. So that's a $50 buy. $50 price chart saying it's only worth 40. However, you have to keep in mind, there's only 300 of these in the world, so I'm willing to pay $50 to complete the Pokemon Fossil set. I only want PSA 10s for a completed set, and this is one locked in the bank, so I'll take it. Let's open one more pack and we'll wrap this video up. If you guys are new to the channel, we do Pokemon stuff here all the time. So stop by, check in, follow, subscribe, hit that like button, whatever you want to do. Let's open one more pack though. Brilliant stars. I have a booster box of these, so I will be opening more packs daily. So stay tuned. Here comes the final pack. Here's the card. One, two, three, four to the back. Energy. I want something here. We haven't had anything this entire video. Literally, two times we opened a pack, I don't know, might have been three, had no hollow. Uh, just a plain card. Come on, this has to be redemption. Oh, I pulled two. That's okay. One more. Come on, boys and girls. Da -da 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 Drum roll. What is it? <laughs> on the final pack of the video we lock in the gold bat pokemon fossil first edition only 300 in the world locked in and then on the final pack of the night no <laughs> oh my gosh and that's rainbow art we're going to drop some comps to let you know how much this is worth. RCS V-Star Rainbow on the last pack of the night. Guys, subscribe and press that like button for that crazy pull. I'll catch you guys tomorrow, next video. See you later.